My name is Dr. Guru Prasad Bhatt. I am a consultant in pulmonology at Manipal Hospital, Bangalore. Asthma is a chronic uh, lung disease where there is a narrowing of the tubes uh, um, in the lungs and this is uh, associated with uh, breathlessness, wheezing and uh, coughing and chest uh, tightness. Some people get a chest discomfort as well. And uh, prevention is always uh, easier than the treatment. The prevention is mainly by uh, taking inhalers on a regular basis um, as prescribed by the doctor. And the other things to do are to avoid any precipitants such as uh, dust, pollution and anything that uh, the asthmatic may be allergic to such as uh, pets or uh, smoke. If you are an active smoker, if, you are, if the asthmatic is an active smoker, they have to quit smoking. And in terms of infections, uh, certainly uh, having immunization for uh, pneumonia and flu would help to prevent asthma attacks. Uh, Flare-ups um, or uh, exacerbations, uh, um, technically they, they are any uh, worsening of the symptoms. Uh, now we have to say there will be day-to-day uh, -day slight variations, but this is uh, over and above those day-to-day uh, uh, -day variation. If there is a real change, mainly increase in breathlessness or increased sputum production or uh, a general worsening, the patient may find it difficult to speak or, or they will um, find it very difficult to breathe, those sort of symptoms. And um, the patient should generally have some uh, idea and advice from his doctor regarding what to do in the case of a flare-up. Usually it is doubling the dose of the regular uh, inhaler therapy. Um, this should control some of the flare-ups. But if it is a major flare-up, they may need uh, further medications, visit to the doctor and in severe cases, they may need hospitalization for uh, uh, nebulization and intravenous medications. So that is the whole range of the flare-ups. After treatment of the asthma, as in after the asthma attack has been treated, um, it depends on whether it is an outpatient or an inpatient. Either way, there is a further risk of having an attack within the next month. That is the highest uh, risk period. So, uh, firstly, the patient should make sure that uh, they take the inhalers and the medicines as advised by the doctor. And they should uh, have frequent checks with the doctor during that one month. And if there are any major symptoms, they should come back to the hospital. So, uh, it's important to stress that uh, when you have one asthma attack, um, treated, there may be a risk of another one coming immediately after that. So, patients have to be careful for the first few weeks after the attack.